So if you would prefer to use a graphic equalizer over the parametric, here's how you can do a high pass filter. Essentially, we'll manually drag each of these little nodes down and model this curve in where we position our little uh, nodes or dots here. So I've got that curve there and it looks somewhat like that. I can also here reduce the slope of the curve or increase the slope of the curve depending. Um, not necessary, but something you can play with as well. So the good news is that's all you need to do for EQ with your voiceovers. You don't need to go crazy. It's not a huge process. If all you want to do is that high pass filter, you're right as rain. And the reason why is oftentimes the engineers that you're working with, the clients that you're sending your recordings to, they'll have people there that will fine tune things to get them to sound exactly the way I, they want in the final product.